Doesn't seem like a place you find good men. We're not looking for good men. We're looking for mercenaries. We have no hope of taking the fortress without them. If we make it far enough to hire them, with those things out there... These bones! This place has swallowed things larger than us! And spat them ah! by those worms! They'll kill us all! Run! Get off the sand! It's all sand! <laughs> Keep calm! Keep moving! Where? Anywhere that isn't sand! I was hoping it wasn't a corpse I was dragging home. Be a bit weird, that, eh? <laughs> My man, <coughs> what happened? I'm sorry, lad. They weren't as lucky as you. Thank you for saving me. Oh, don't thank me. Uh, thank this. <clears throat> that little darling's a bit twitchy, but she should get you up to my camp, no trouble. I've uh, got a newer one myself. Worked out all the hitches. Hitches? Word of advice about the claim. If you don't like heights, don't look down. And if you don't like dwarf asses, don't look up. <sighs> this device, you built it? You don't need to flatter me, lad. I already snatched you from the nasties. No, what you got there's Numenorians. Loads of their contrivances scattered around from way back. Very useful. Trick is, grabbing it without the worms grabbing you. I found a few promising sites, got them all sketched out. You bring what you find back to me, I'll tinker till it does what it used to. Or does something, anyway. Then you can field test it. Make sure it's safe. Sound good? More than fair. the most convenient spot if you're moving in furniture. But on the plus side, worms don't like heights. So, what are you doing so far from Gondor? Looking for the Vanishing Sons. They're a mercenary company. Yes, I hired a few of them to look for Numenorian bits. Now I owe their leader a few <clears throat> mercenaries. I've got just the thing to get you to where they are. Just don't tell them where I am. What do I do? Just run off the edge of the cliff. Run off the edge of the cliff? And here, these are the places to poke around for more Numenorian goodies. Go on then. I've used this thing myself. Not a bump or a scratch.
Figure what out? Just have to not think about it, is all. Right. Getting the hang of it. All right, this... this is... Whoa! Blood? Oh, it's even worse. Might as well just dip the entire thing in rook blood, so that it's all one color. Actually, that's not a bad idea. You ever see that dwarf run? My name is Berenu. I am second captain of the Gondorian Guard at Minas Ethel. Minas Ethel has fallen some time ago, I believe. I am seeking soldiers. Well, it's difficult to be a captain without them. Lucky for you, I've got the finest warriors in all of Middle Earth! <laughs> Do you carry coin of any kind? Some. Some. You're going to need a lot more than some. <laughs> What are your plans for the Wraith? I assume you're not planning to retake Minas Ethel. I'm planning to take Shindrum. The fortress? No, 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 no. <laughs> that sounds like the work for heroes. All I can offer you are mercenaries. Look, why don't you come back when you have some more money? Or sense? What art? How do you know that name? You haven't changed! I remember a boy of seven, small for his age, so he had a lot to prove. And one day he decided that he was going to explore the caves of Umbar, but he got himself into a little bit of trouble. Lucky for him, he had a brother, a beautiful, courageous older brother who was sent to look for him. And by the time that champion reached him, he was moments away from being devoured by Karagors. <laughs> Karagors? Jagai? No, 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 little brother. I... I am Serka now. Serka, the unkillable. Serka, the insufferable. Serka, the survivor. But I still bear some scars from my former life. How did you come to be here? Among these Easterlings? Same old story. A village is raided, homes are looted, mothers and fathers are slaughtered, screaming tears. Orcs. Mercenaries. How is it? I should be thankful, though, of course, eh? Not every boy gets the chance to be raised among such a merry band of killers and thieves! <laughs> but you lead them. Yeah, only until I get a knife in my back. And believe me, that is how all leaders end up. But enough history. Blood only goes so far. You and I, we have business to transact. If I'm going to take that fortress, I better start with something smaller. Let's see about those outposts. I was surprised when I first saw the fortress here.
Serko wants me to meet with him. I should find out what he wants. Tell me, brother, what do you see? Orcs, wagons, more orcs. Do you know what I see? Coin, fortune, and enough danger to make it fun. It seems you have better eyes than I do. It looks too, but who's keeping track? I suppose this coin you speak of is in those wagons, those surrounded by guards. They're soon to be dead guards. No survivors. The Overlord can't know that this is us. After all, he is paying us to keep these deliveries safe. You're working for the Orcs? <sighs> Look, in this line of work, I can't choose where my coin comes from. Besides, if you're thinking about taking over that fortress, you're going to need my men. And if you need men, you need coin. Help me, brother. I'll give you a family discount. How generous. Keep an eye out for wereworms. They're drawn to grog. <laughs> Why are we stopped for a bunch of globs in the rear? Because they've got the grog. And if we show up at the fortress without the grog, the overlord will tell us apart. You make a good point. If I go two <laughs> days without grog, the only thing that makes me feel better is killing something. Supplies come through this canyon. This coin is from Minisithu.
This is all Gondorian coin. And now, it's Easterling coin. Let's get these wagons back to the Oasis. Today, we get paid. These caravans have to stop. You and your boys need to get all this grog cleaned up before any wereworms show up. And don't spill any more, or you'll bring the rumbler here. The rumbler? Sounds like just what I need. It's time to spill some grog. What have you done? Cut off the enemy's supply line. That was also my supply line! I need to keep the coin flowing. Do you see those men back there? Those are not soldiers. Their loyalty is bought, and when they stop getting paid, their blades are no longer under my control. These are marauder orcs. When we take their fortress, you'll get half their fortune, and I'll use the other half to pay you and your men for whatever comes next. All right. You know, coin is one thing. That fortress is another. Oh, I hope you've got a great plan. <laughs> Now I just need a plan. Time to find out what we're up against.
found this odd piece of metal in the sand the other day. Picked it up and it got real hot. Then hot again, depending on where I pointed it. Dwarf men collecting things like mm. that. Turns them into it about. <laughs> Look, that's If you're serious about taking this fort, and getting me my coin, we'll need to find out what we're up against. And we'll need to be discreet. I wouldn't want to ruin your reputation among the Orcs. Chose his war chiefs well. He's called Takra, the Sand Spider. Encourages competition within his ranks. Weed out the weak. Provocation. Those orders come straight from Baraku. They're going to be needed in the next great war. The most use blind on like space Not rats or orcs. How do you work with these? Beasts. Oh, they're not much different from mercenaries. They like to drink, to sing, and to kill. Oh, that's a devil's breath. Oh, one second. Did you hear that? Where are you going, always? You've lived a hard life, Jagai. But I survived, didn't I? I lived long enough to meet you again. That's better than most. You, you just have no idea, do you? <laughs> Fresher, I wonder. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so I breathe down my neck. What was that noise? How have you survived among the Easterlings? By letting Jagai die. By becoming Serka. Jagai was weak, afraid. He could be hurt, killed. Serka cannot. <laughs> oh, he's in fine form tonight. Tonight, he's moved all the remaining crooks. <laughs> we'll have to take this fortress before I run out of coin. Mercenaries are loyal only as long as you can pay them. They'll get their money. Your weak! 
We're almost done, but I'm not leaving here empty-handed. I think I saw some gold back there. Finish up so we can leave. made him angry. Maybe a good time to leave. Get him! Up there! He's up there! If you take a shot at the Overlord, you don't miss! Ah, <laughs> you go! You're one of those refugees from Minas Morgul, aren't you? Sad story. <laughs> Well, I think it's time we left, little brother. Or do you want to try and get us killed again? Time to leave. We're losing them! We're not They're getting away! Now we know what we're dealing with. I've seen two kinds of mercenary, brother. One of them fights for gold, and the other seeks death in whatever way he can find it. I'm starting to think you're the second kind. There's no turning back now. The Orcs were bound to retaliate after our infiltration of their fortress. The only question is how hard they've struck back. <laughs> 